so first off, I want to say that I am a 22 year old male on a budget and uh, this is the first time I've ever lived by myself. I've had roommates in the past while I was in school, but pretty much I've been really, really liking this place and liking the feel and the vibe of it. I like the black, white and tan wood aesthetic. It's really cool. So I think the square feet for this apartment is about 420 to 440. I can't remember the exact number. So it's, it's a little bit on the smaller side, but the tall ceilings actually really make it feel spacious. Um, it's technically a studio apartment, but it actually has a divider wall right here to separate the living area to the bedroom area. And I really, really like that because most studios that I've toured were just straight out like that. So it's really nice to have that wall for privacy if I have guests over or what. It just It's a really nice separator wall. Uh, where was I going with that? Oh yeah, so the cool thing about this place that really made me want it is that the rent was super cheap and they also had a amenities fee that covers my water, trash, sewer, cable, and internet, all for $105. And the only thing I'd have to pay outside of that is electricity. And I just thought that was an amazing deal because everything else I've looked at has been like $1,000 without utilities. So probably like add on an extra 200 makes it 1200 and I'm only gonna pay I believe I'm paying six I believe it's 695 for rent and then 105 for the utilities and then I'll add on electric it's like eight hundred and forty dollars so it's really cool cuz I'm saving a ton of money living here and this is exactly where I wanted to be anyway one thing that really sold me about this place was the parking garage because it's literally you come out the door and you turn right and it's maybe a 10 second walk if that and you go inside of the building to take the elevator up and you're there so I really really like that and it keeps my car out of the weather and if it snows these roads will most likely be plowed first because it's downtown so I'm very much excited for that uh, so just sit back and enjoy the video so this is me about two months in the future I decided to refilm some of this video because I've gotten some upgrades to this apartment since I filmed the original video and I also have a beard. Yeah, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys around my apartment and try to make it as brief and entertaining as possible, so. Okay. Okay. Please excuse my shorts. These are my relaxing shorts. So to give a little bit of a tour on my actual kitchen area, I have these very I have these very nice stainless steel appliances. I have a refrigerator, microwave, stove, and refrigerator. The refrigerator has a couple marks on it, but it was here before I was moved in pretty much, so I didn't do it. Um, everything works really good. I wasn't expecting to actually have stainless steel appliances because it's not really common. Um, for a lot of apartments in this area or to have wooden floors so I thought that was pretty cool um, I have very tall cabinets so obviously this is why I'm on a stool but anyway I have these really nice big cabinets I have some storage space up here above my microwave and yeah pretty much it's a very spacious spacious kitchen I like it that I can have enough room to work here and yeah these drawers they close super easy they have like a like a non slam thing in it so it won't slam um, another thing that I have I actually have a dishwasher I have a full dishwasher and it's very small but it does the job for what I need it for um, if you take a look at my fridge I don't know if I want to show this so I pretty much have only drinks. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I also have my, okay, I don't know if I want to show. I didn't think it's there. Was that cool? Okay, so this is my bedroom area. Uh, I, I have a queen bed that I bought off of Amazon. Pretty much everything on this bed is from Amazon. Uh, I haven't really decorated in here yet, so there's nothing on the walls. I have my diploma frame and a VT neon light. I thought it was cool. Got it from Walmart. 
and then I have my little area with like my vitamins and like my watches and all my like jewelry and stuff have that there my oscillating fan which is nice because I, I like a loud fan but this one works really well and it's kind of loud I have a window sill as my nightstand pretty much I have a nice really antique lamp right here yep right so this is my closet and it's kind of small but honestly for me it's perfect I have a washer and dryer and this is one thing that I was looking for when I was looking for an apartment because most either had a hookup but no washer and dryer or they only had like a community laundry room and I didn't really want to have to share anybody's laundry things so this is pretty much my dream to have this in my closet it's also very nice because I can take it straight out of the dryer and or hang it or whatever and I can put it back into where it needs to go but I have the bulk of my clothes in here um, usually have my nice clothes hanging up I have like all my hoodies and long sleeves and stuff up on the top up here junk there pretty much uh, have all my shoes right here on this shoe stand so I have a good bit of walking space you know I can do a little so one little hack if you are trying to save space and you have a lot of clothes or you have a lot of little clothes that can be compacted uh, I have these storage cubes down here six of them got them from Walmart and pretty much fit all my stuff in here like all my shorts socks underwear um, like sweatpants joggers everything goes in there any kind of pants like dress pants I hang up but yeah it's really convenient and then I also have a little space for my duffel bag yeah so next This is my favorite part of the apartment and this is why I refilmed. But I now have a 55 inch TV that I got on Black Friday hanging on my wall. Yes, thank you. Um, but like I said, this is my favorite area of the apartment. I love the fact that I have enough room here now to actually have a good spacious area to do work in. I have my MacBook here, which I'm hopefully moving to a monitor setup um, soon. I also have like my notebooks and stuff here, a little love letter from my lovely amazing girlfriend, um, plant, well, we love fake plants, I also have many fake plants, and I also have these nice lamps, which there's one in the corner that you can't see, but they change colors, depending on my mood, it's pretty cool, but this is my favorite area, and this is usually where I would film videos. So this is my couch area. I have a nice end table I got from Walmart. It's kind of comfy. It doubles as a futon, so if I have guests over, I can sleep here. But I need a mattress pad because it's very uncomfortable sometimes. Okay, so I just wanted to throw this in, but this tree my mom actually gave me and she helped me decorate it, so I wanted to put it in the video. Yeah. This is my mirror. Okay, so this is my bathroom. I'll have some b-roll of it, but I really like my nice sink, counter, floors are really nice, the toilet, very small, doesn't take up the space. Yeah, it's a very small bathroom, but it has everything that I need, plenty of storage, and it even has a medicine cabinet, which I didn't realize it had. So yeah, pretty cool. I'm back here to film the outro, and I just want to say thank you so much for watching. If you did watch this, if you enjoyed it, please give it a like. If you're curious to where any of these products and stuff came from, just leave a comment down below and I'll link it to you no matter where it is. Uh, but I just got to say it's probably from Amazon. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'm really hoping I can get this video up soon because I have really been missing YouTube a lot. And uh, yeah, okay. So see you guys in the next video if I make another video soon, hopefully. Okay, peace out guys. Thanks for watching.